Stuck at sea for nearly two months as a global pandemic explodes, hundreds of cruise ship workers are finally being allowed to return home after being refused entry into the U.S. for several weeks now. KCAL 9's Hermela Arguawi uh, spoke to one of those workers who finally got off the ship this morning in San Pedro. They're just really treating us like disease vectors. They're treating the cruise ship industry like we are just all sick and we're gonna infect the United States. Melinda Mann arrived in San Pedro this morning after being stuck on a cruise ship for 55 days. No family, no friends, with her hundreds of other cruise employees who she says didn't test positive for COVID-19, also waiting to get home. It's super frustrating, super stressful. I've never really been an anxious person in my life, but I've had more anxiety attacks since this started than I hope to ever have again. Man has been working as a youth entertainment coordinator on cruises since 2017, most recently for Holland America. She says she loves her job, but this experience has left her shaken. I feel like my mental health is a lot more shaky now than it was, like just sheer isolation. Like I was spending like 21 hours a day in my cabin. Man also says on top of being stuck on board without her loved ones, the cruise line's attempts to social distance and technology issues made her feel even more lonely. At mealtimes, we weren't allowed to look at each other for the longest time. All of the tables faced away from each other. We could only communicate really by text. I couldn't see my family because the internet connection is so bad you couldn't video chat. So there were, <laughs> it was very isolating. It will be a long day's travel for man who There's lives in Georgia and talked to us while on a bus to a local like airport. She tells us the plane she's on will drop people off in Dallas before making its way to Orlando, where her mom is driving six hours to pick her up and finally take her home. I am home in the USA now and I, I'm supposed to feel happy about that, but I'm really still feeling very stressed and anxious, just like leftover anxiety from this whole ordeal. We reached out to Holland America, the cruise operator, and they just told us they have been working with the CDC for approval to return its crew members home. Hermela Argawi, KCAL 9 News.